All right. Housekeeping. It is December 1st, and we are talking about the December freebies, all of the awesome promos that Young Living is giving us this month. And we're also going to chat a little bit about the business opportunity, because that's always something good to talk about. Um, who doesn't want free money? Um, plus all the other benefits. So those are the things we're going to be chatting about tonight. If you're joining us on Zoom, we do record these and we post them to YouTube. They also go live on Facebook on our groups. So if you don't want your beautiful face or handsome face, my dad is joining us this evening. If you don't want your face to seen on uh, social media channels, um, just hit the camera slash like no camera button. And then um, you can still have your voice heard if you'd like to be heard. Um, we love hearing all of you and hearing your comments and your questions. Um, if you don't want your voice heard, or if you have a lot of background noise, like I just had to turn off my baby monitor, um, or if you've got animals going on in the background, or like the other week we had construction going on, um, by all means hit the slash and mute your microphone. That way we don't have a bunch of background noise from everyone who's watching. So that's our housekeeping. Um, something we're doing this month, because we understand there's a lot of stuff going on, a lot of holiday stuff, a lot of people are exhausted from holiday activities, or like B is having trouble with her internet this evening. Um, so replays are going to be really big this month, and we didn't want our regular um, live viewership to suffer. And um, because we give two points for those who post that they're watching the live of our Oily Fireside Chats, and we didn't want them to lose out on points. So this month, if you're having troubles um, just socially or internet wise or otherwise, if you're having trouble watching live, um, put comments that you're watching the replay and anyone who watches the replay will also get two entries. So we're, we're upping that for replay viewers. All replay viewers also get two entries. And then we're doing something else where if you comment something like, um, oh, I'm using this oil for this this week, or today I tried this oil in my diffuser for the first time and loved it, or I was curious about how this oil would work for X, Y, Z, so I tried it, like, to help my kids calm down for bed. I tried peace and calming, or whatever. Some, some like, oily, helpful comment to help others out. It doesn't have to be long. It could just be, I'm diffusing stress away. Whatever you want to post, Comment it under our videos, and you also get a point for that. Normally, we don't do an extra comment or an extra point on the prize wheel just for, like, a comment. Um, we give you a point for watching, but not a point for, like, kind of, not vague comments, but just, like, a general comment. But this month, we are doing that for you just as a little extra Christmas gift giveaway thing. Um, so lots of extra ways to get on the prize wheel this month. Don't forget that sharing the videos also gives you um, prizes, um, oh, I can't talk today, Anne, you may have to take over, um, sharing the video also gets you entries onto the prize wheel, so, and that's all the time, that's not just December, so that's a few extra things we're doing for you this month, this season of giving and Christmas spirit. All right, take it away, Anne, give us an oil. <laughs> okay, um, well, I wanted to start off you know, we're highlighting some of the oils that you can get for free this month, um, depending on, you know, like how much product you order um, kind of determines what you get for free. Um, so it's kind of a big deal. Um, so one of my, and you know, I say this every week, one of my favorites, <laughs> Okay, so they're all my favorite. You can't pick a favorite. <laughs> right. Let's just get that out on the board right now. I've, I've got a top 50. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, Northern Light Black Spruce is wow. Wow, 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 wow. Um, it is phenomenal. Um, and it is, um, let me just kind of give a little background of to kind of give you, like, take you on a little imagination ride for a minute, okay? So just think about this, okay? It's a, a mix of crisp, uplifting scents of woodsy comfort, 
to calm your mind and inspire deep meditation. Um, so think about trees, calmness, just nature. Just think about that for a minute. Um, it, um, the strength is enhanced by the natural challenges of the environment to grow ever taller and dignified, reaching upward to the energy of the dancing northern lights in the sky. Okay, so British Columbia. Um, I have actually been there. I've been to British Columbia. Um, and this was not an oil that Young Living had at the time that I was in British Columbia. However, British Columbia is absolutely beautiful. It is a beautiful place to go. So if you haven't been there, you need to go. Um, so Northern Lights Black Spruce was introduced back in 2015. Um, and it was um, really the farm in and of itself was really not only, not only developed by Gary Young, um, the founder of Young Living, but also a couple of Royal Crown Diamonds, Ben and Carol Howden and their family. They work tirelessly in frigid temperatures, okay? So yeah, it can be pretty cold there. However, when I was there, it wasn't cold. <laughs> um, but it gave the world a source of black spruce essential oil that was untouched by synthetic chemicals and fertilizers. Um, so now, uh, Corey Howden, is the Northern Lights farm manager, it carries on the legacy of Gary Young, who um, passed away a couple years ago. Um, it is just one of Young Living's uh, 16 global farms and numerous partner and sealed, seed to seal certified farms committed to the highest standard of purity and authenticity. Every winter, during winter harvest, members can experience Young Living's unique seal to seal process firsthand, harvesting and distilling the deep gratitude of nature's living energy. So for those of you that don't know, Young Living welcomes you to visit their farms at any time. You can see the process. It is the coolest thing ever. I know that in another year or two, um, my team and I, we are going to go to um, Young Living Convention, and we're going to go to the Mona um, Young Living Farm, and it's going to knock it's going to knock their socks off. I've been there, um, so I know what to expect. But a lot of my team hasn't, and I'm just looking forward to seeing them experience that firsthand. Now, how do you use Northern Lights Black Spruce? Okay, so now remember, I've already got you thinking, okay, we're, we're in the forest. It's nice and calm and relaxing, kind of a woodsy scent. Um, you can apply it during a massage uh, with a carrier oil. Um, you can diffuse it for an invigorating aroma. I actually add orange with it. It is awesome. Totally awesome. Orange or tangerine, one of those two is what I usually use. I've got frankincense in my diffuser with Northern Lights right now. Oh yeah, that would be good too. It's amazing. Um, you, can, um, you can dilute it and use with a couple of other oils, Aroma Seas or Cool Azul, uh, before, during, and after exercise. Oh, that, that would be kind of a nice, nice fragrance. Um, you can also add it to your skincare products and add a dimension of woodsy aroma. Um, <clears throat> let's see. Um, just a couple of things. Um, this is one that I'm going to try. I have not put this together yet as a combination in my diffuser, but how about Northern Lights, Black Spruce, and Jasmine? Ooh. Mm-hmm. You'd have like woodsy and floral at the same time. Woodsy and floral at the same time. It would be like walking through a meadow on the edge of a forest. That just mm -hmm. sounds beautiful. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so there's so many things that you can, you can use these oils for. Um, so let me just kind of paint a picture of what's in this oil. Okay. 
So we've got, um, let's see. Mm. No, we're just going to go, I'm, I'm just setting the mood of the relaxing woodsy scent. I'm just going to. You're not going to read us the Latin names of the trees? Uh, <laughs> yes, I'm just going to leave it at that. And I want you to just be thinking about, hmm. Anne's looking at, how do I pronounce that? Nope, just kidding. <laughs> yeah, just forget it. <laughs> it's been a long day. Forget I've never done that. <laughs> uh, so, this is why it's so much fun to do these <laughs> chats. These are great. Um, so it's just, it's one of my favorite oils. I just, in fact, I was like, I had my, the 15 ml bottle and it was down to like, just so I'm like, oh, I got to get myself another one. I'm like, I'm not even just going with the five milliliter, but I think. The freebie at 190 PV is a five milliliter bottle of Northern Lights Black Spruce. Am I correct, Tessa? Yes. At 190, it is. This is for essential rewards. You have correct. to essential rewards for this one. Correct. So correct. the essential rewards bonus at the 190 tier is a five ml of Northern Lights Black Spruce. Mm -hmm. Perfect. Perfect. All right, so I'm going to pass the baton back to you. All right. Um, two things I want to add. Luke uses it as a cologne, and he got a comment from my father-in-law this weekend of, what's that for? And uh, my father-in-law is not super into oils. Like, he'll, he'll observe us use oils when we visit them or when they visit us, but he's not, like... Oh, what's that? Oh, can I try that? I think I've gotten oils on my father-in-law like three times. Um, but he was interested in it because it smelled so good. Luke got rid of all of his chemical -y colognes, all of that gross stuff that you buy at the store. And he just uses um, like Northern Lights Black Spruce or he'll switch it up with, he likes frankincense as a cologne. Um, I did one for him with cedarwood and orange and he really likes that one. But Northern Lights Black Spruce is his go-to. That's his favorite. And he gets a lot of comments on it. He never got comments when he was wearing Axe or Old Spice or any of that gross stuff, but he gets a lot of comments on how good he smells, sometimes from women, which makes me <laughs> but <laughs> he gets a lot of comments on how good it smells. So I would encourage men to make that cologne switch because it mm -hmm. makes a difference. Um, and then the other thing is I'm also very excited to go and visit the farms. Um, I have not been, and that's one of our Anne was talking about our team trip. I'm very excited. I'm I'm mm -hmm. actually very excited because Anne's going to be going and she's been there so she can like point out the highlights and this was my favorite last time or um, I'm really excited to show you this or it's it's nice to go with someone who knows the lay of the land. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So one of the things I'm going to be talking about tonight is the mini travel passive diffuser which is available at the 250 PV tier, and that's available for a shop order or an ER order. You'll get it for either one. Now, this is an exclusive product that isn't available to buy, so I don't have one. They, like, it's, it's available now for this month. So what I did is I pulled up the video where the ladies talk about it, because who's going to know better than one who has one? So I'm going to share screen here, and then you get to watch a very nice video from our ladies at Young Living. Let's see if I can go full screen without losing zoom. Okay, cool. All right, so we're going to, I think they talk about it for like a minute and a half. So we're going to listen to them talk about this. And Anne, give me a thumbs up that you can see it and hear it, okay, because I'm not sure about sound. Yeah. Now, when you place a 250 PV order, we are giving you guys this passive diffuser. Now, this is super cute. I feel like it blends really good with like the Aria. It just blends in with like home decor and it looks, it's, it's like really modern. Like mid-century modern, but also kind of farmhouse, any type of decor. It looks so cute with it. This is ceramic. This middle part is ceramic and there's bamboo on the outer edge. And what you do is you just place like three to four drops of oil on this ceramic material there. right there. Just drop it on there and then it diffuses oils just throughout the day. So and these are really good to use in your car. If you don't have a car diffuser, I love using passive diffusers in my closet because we don't have a, an outlet in our closet. And so 
It's good just to keep your clothes smelling fresh and clean, or if you have any space in your house, like there's not an outlet, or you don't have a diffuser for that area, throw in a passive diffuser and it's perfect. Or take it with you on the go, like throw it in a gym bag and your purse, I mean, Silver in your pocket, you yeah. know, <laughs> <laughs> you know, all day, you know. <laughs> um, the packaging for this is 100% recyclable, so that's, that's another it. fun tip for this, too. Yeah, make sure you're recycling the packaging. Yep, so awesome. All right, and then at the all right, so isn't that cool? Like, what a neat little thing. I love when she was talking about um, throwing it in her closet. Oh, no, I started again. Sorry, hang on. Okay. Um, I love when she was talking about using it in her closet, because seriously, who has all this in their closet? And, like, the diffuser, because most of our diffusers are also humidifiers, you'd get moisture in there, and you don't want moisture in your closet. So having a passive diffuser, that's such an ingenious idea. And, like, uh, growing up, my folks lined one of the closets in our house with cedar wood. It was like cedar, cedar chip planks or something like that to keep like insects, especially moths out because mothballs are super dangerous around little kids. So they did like these cedar plank thingies in the closet. You could put cedar wood, drops of cedar wood on one of those passive diffusers and throw that in your closet. Also, if you have mice in your house, I believe it's peppermint and help me out, Anne. Is it lemon? that mice don't like, or rosemary. I know for sure the peppermint. Mice hate peppermint. And then I think it's also lemon or rosemary. I think it's rosemary. Rosemary? Yeah. So put a few drops of peppermint and rosemary, and you can put that little passive diffuser like in your kitchen cabinets or under your counter, wherever you have mice coming in or whatever, and then they'll stay away. So how cool are passive diffusers? I have a tendency when we leave the house to like shove cotton balls in the vents if we're going to be gone for a week. But when I get home, I'm finding cotton balls for like two weeks because forgetful me forgets where I put them. <laughs> so I'm like finding cotton balls for two weeks. How awesome to find like beautiful little passive diffusers all over the house. <laughs> that would be a so much better option. <laughs> so that's mine for that. And you've got... I've got, did you know that if you order minimum... $100, either Essential Rewards or Shop, $100, you get free shipping. Mm -hmm. So you could, you could do an Essential Rewards order, and you could also do a Shop order in the same month. And, and if you redeem your Essential Rewards points and it's $100, you also get free shipping. Oh, you think? I love free shipping. It's awesome. Yeah, so it's it's a lot of strategy. You know, I'm one that kind of hoards my ER <clears throat> points for a while. You. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I don't spend them right away. I let them accumulate. And so I strategize. Okay, so what can I, what can I get? What can I, you know, how do I want to spend these points? Um, I can say that over the last... Let's see, how many years have I been doing this? Seven or eight years? Seven or eight years, I have literally received thousands of dollars worth of free product. Oh, yeah. And rewards. Thousands. Well, you're getting 25% back. That's really easy to do. I mean, we get exactly. hundreds a year. Exactly. Yeah. You know, so it's... It's such an awesome thing. And it's something you can look forward to like every month, you know, all of a sudden you look, look out on your doorstep and you're like, Oh, there's my young living box. I can't wait. You and know? it's all stuff you use. I mean, whether you're using these to make your home smell better or to make your man smell better or your kids calm down. I mean, this is all mm -hmm. stuff you're using. Sometimes yep. with rewards programs, it's like, Oh, you earned yourself a free bag, and you're like, I have all these totes already. What am I going to use another bag for? Or, oh, right. you earned yourself ten dollars off shoes. I don't really need. Okay, that's a bad example. My mother-in-law hoard shoes. But anyway, like you know, sometimes it's things you can't use. I love Young Living's ER points rewards. It's stuff that you pick out that you want. Yes, yes. It's it's just you know like I. I kind of like always have my eyes on, you know, the more expensive oils that I probably wouldn't like purchase, but if I can accumulate those ER points and then get it, then it's like, it's even better. <laughs> Essentially, I'm getting it for free. Basically. Basically. And if you, you know, if you order things like 
Jasmine, for example, is a more expensive oil. So I'd have to put something else with it in order to bring that total up to 100 to get the free shipping. But I would do it because I want the free shipping. You know, there's, there's always, you know, some way that you can, you can get, you know, you can work the system, so to speak. So I, I absolutely love that fact. It's something that Young Living um, introduced just this year. Mm -hmm. um, and, and I really like it. I, I really like it. And I'm glad that, that we have it available. So. Especially on things like, because previous to this, they were shipping by weight. And when you're Correct. ordering things like shampoo and conditioner and your Thieves Household Cleaner and your Thieves Laundry Soap and your Nink Show, which we drink mm -hmm. every day here, that stuff mm -hmm. gets heavy. I mean, we were paying a lot of money on shipping. So to have mm -hmm. the option of free shipping at 100 PV, that's a huge lifesaver. That's saving us a ton of money. Yep. Yep, for sure. For sure. Do you do you want me to uh, share about another oil that is kind of on the lineup, or do you want to go and then I'll go? Um. Well, I've got frankincense, and then I was going to chat a little bit about the opportunity. And you've got okay. right? Yep. Yep. I think you had a few things about the opportunity you were going to share. So frankincense, and let me double check. I'm pretty sure it's the 15 ml. Yep. Mm -hmm. 15 ml. And this is at the 300 PV tier. And this is for both ER and shop rewards. So if you spend 300 PV, you get this big of a bottle, this big of a bottle for free. People wait all year for this promo and they have it usually either November or December. And I love that it's December this year. I think last year it was November. I love that it's December just because what were the three gifts the wise men brought Jesus? Gold, mm -hmm. frankincense, and myrrh. So I just think that's a really special, like, Christmas freebie because one of our gifts is frankincense. I feel a little bit like baby Jesus. Not quite, not quite that holy, but I feel a little bit like baby Jesus. <laughs> I think that's a wonderful plan for them. So frankincense, I know we've talked about it on a number of other oily fireside chats. I'm diffusing it tonight with Northern Lights Black Spruce. I love that it's spiritually grounding. Something I started doing... Ooh, probably a year ago now. It was pre-corona. I know now we're using corona as a time period. Pre-corona lockdown uh, when we were going to church um, to help focus on what our pastor was talking about. I would do a drop or two of frankincense right on the crown of my head. And it was really, I noticed a difference on the Sundays I did it versus the Sundays I didn't. And you wouldn't think one or two drops of oils would make that big of a difference. But dropping frankincense on your head with the spiritual grounding that it has, there's a reason this oil is mentioned as much as it is in the Bible. And there's a reason it was used in anointing oils like for Moses and that it was given to baby Jesus. It's a really, really wonderful oil. It's got wonderful frequencies to it. I love how grounding it is. It is one of the top, I think it's the top oil for skin with lavender as the runner up. Um, frankincense has over 10,000 uses and they're still documenting more. This oil is, um, under research in the, sorry, if you can hear my washing machine right now, it's on its spin cycle and it's really loud. <laughs> I should be muting my mic <laughs> for background noise. Um, so, um, I, I just love that this oil has found so many uses for things. Um, they're discussing for their, like, uh, the PV promo flyer. It says, put your freshest face forward. Cold weather got your skin feeling frostbitten. Place a drop of frankincense in your palm and pair it with your favorite lotion for a date night ready dewy skin. And that actually works. I love how frankincense works on your face. It just like really gives you that lovely glow. And then this one is kind of what I was talking about with, with church. It says, spark spirituality, invite the spirit of the season into your home by diffusing this oil's empowering aroma when you are seeking purpose or engaged in prayer or meditation. Um, I have used this oil during yoga. Um, not that I do that for like spiritual reasons, but just like the grounding and the purpose and the refreshing um, for my soul. Like I, I pray when I do yoga and it's really, I love how refreshed I feel afterwards. I feel physically and emotionally grounded and then spiritually, 
I feel like instead of doing the normal prayer squirrel on a Ferris wheel kind of a deal or squirrel on a merry round thing of like, dear Lord, I thank you for, oh, I need that on my grocery list. Oh, and uh, please help the girls sleep really well tonight. Did I wash Harris's sheep? Like, like, you know how your brain just kind of does that when you're praying? I don't have that when I use frankincense. When I use frankincense, I'm actually able to focus on what I'm praying about and get through my mental list of things and people to pray for. So I really love diffusing frankincense when I'm praying or doing yoga. I really love using frankincense on the top of my head when I'm studying my Bible or doing devos or at church. Um, it's, it's just a super great, and the skin benefits. Like, I can't talk enough about the skin benefits, but spiritually, we haven't really talked about that one too much. And I feel like this month with December and focusing on the reason for the season and those kinds of things, I feel like frankincense is a really good oil to talk about and just a fantastic freebie. And normally frankincense, because it is a more expensive oil, typically this is in the 400 PV tier. Um, they would bump us up to a 400 PV tier and then we get other free oils in there, obviously. Um, but the fact that we can get it for only 300 PV as a freebie, that's phenomenal. Young Living is being so generous this month, you guys. They're giving us wonderful, wonderful oils for free this month. So that's what I've got on frankincense, unless Anne wants to share some stuff. But No, you pretty, you pretty much covered it. It is, um, it is a really phenomenal oil for the skin. Um, you know, it's called, you know, it's known as, frankincense is known as the, the king or the daddy of, of essential oils. I mean, that's, it's very, very, very important uh, for all the reasons that Tessa just, just gave. Um, and, you know, I love diffusing it and it's, it's just a nice, refreshing um, aroma when you diffuse it, even wearing it, it's, you know, it's just one of those oils that, wow, you know, people, people are going to notice. Um, you had mentioned about Luke wearing the Northern Lights black spruce. Um, I was in the airport a week ago and paying for uh, uh, water or something. And the lady says, you have on essential oils, don't you? And she goes, wait, don't tell me, let me guess. And she tried to guess what I had on. Of course, I didn't have on just one oil. <laughs> so that kind of wasn't fair. But, but I thought that was interesting that she noticed right away that I had on essential oils. It wasn't a perfume. It was essential oils. So, so that was really cool. Yeah, it makes a difference. It really does. It really does. And so, you know, I mean, I think Young Living really focuses a lot on, you know, times of the year where they really want to spoil us and you know i mean december you know we've got winter you know although i don't know about you tessa but here in delaware it's not um it really has not been that cold like we we had um 65 degrees yesterday tons of rain thunderstorm um flooding you know that was the kind of stuff that we had yesterday but today a high of 43 you know so um so that's just what, kind of what what we deal with and you know with that changing temperature and stuff sometimes we're a little prone to having a little bit of a a rundown immune system um and so sometimes we need we just need a little bit of relief and that's where our nice breathe again oil which is at a 190 pv and it's not just an er exclusive oil this month and it's in a 15 milliliter bottle which is awesome you can also get it in a roll-on so you can always have it with you in your purse in your car wherever just in case you need a little relief um, i always find that i would you know put it right along here really kind of clears you out a little bit i don't um, have the 15 ml but this is all i've got so yeah <laughs> that's okay i like the visual thank you it's like this but comes like this <laughs> it's just a it's a very invigorating fresh scent um and it it's actually like a a tingling sensation but in a 
good way. It's like, oh, wow, this is great. And it contains peppermint and eucalyptus. Um, what other things does it have? Um, myrtle, copaiba, um, and actually four different types of eucalyptus in, in this blend, which is like, wow. Um, all the breathing powers. <laughs> all the breathing powers. You know, it, it's got an awakening aroma. That's the word I was looking for. Awakening aroma. Um, no, awakening is a different blend, Anne. That's yeah, that's yeah, I know, I know. I have that one. <laughs> so do I. <laughs> one of my favorites. <laughs> I love that one in the shower in the morning. <laughs> it also, it can provide... Don't confuse people, Anne. We've got too many oils with different names. Don't, don't confuse people. <laughs> It also provides a refreshing uh, scent in like a stuffed environment. So again, you could you could put a few drops on a cotton ball and stick it under the driver's seat in your car, or a passive diffuser, or passive diffuser. <laughs> exactly, exactly. Um, you can also apply it to joint your joints after you've worked out. Uh, because again, it's that cooling, tingling sensation, just kind of relaxing things. Um, carry it in your purse, in your gym bag, wherever. You, that roll-on is, is really, really important to have. Um, so I like the fact that they're giving us like the biggest bang for our buck. Um, because you could always, if you didn't have the already pre-made roll-on, like Tessa um, showed us earlier, you could always use drops out of the bigger bottle and put it in a roller and make your own. Just add a little bit of um, carrier oil, V6 oil, um, whatever, olive oil, how, however you want to do it. Um, it's just, it's just really good to have. Um, let's see. Um, you could also, um, you can also put it under your nose. Um, just be aware, this is this part of your lip, top lip, it's pretty sensitive. <laughs> so just be aware like that you it a little bit. go really light and you might want to dilute it down. Um, just because it is going to be like, woo! And it could bring tears to your eyes even. <laughs> so yeah, um, Breathe Again is... Um, actually, one of my mom's favorites. She, yes, she absolutely loves this blend. So, before they developed the Thieves Chest Rub, um, mm -hmm. I did Breathe Again with coconut oil and beeswax, I think. And I would do that as like a homemade chest rub thing because I didn't like the blue stuff at the store because of the petroleum in it. And I didn't want petroleum on my chest. I just thought that wasn't very good for me. So um, now we have the Thieves Chest Rub, but Breathe Again is really, really good in a pinch. So thank you, Anne. That's awesome. You're welcome. You're welcome. What else do we have? Something I wanted to throw in here, and next up, I've got some opportunity stuff to talk about. Uh, I did want to mention, because this might show up a little bit with Breathe Again, but it definitely showed up for me with frankincense. When I first got that oil, and my liver was crazy out of whack, but I hated the smell of frankincense. It smelled like dirt. Like, <laughs> once you go outside, just grab a handful of dirt and shove it up your nose. Not I. Um, so I hated the smell of frankincense, and every time I tell this story, I know Emily's like, what? I love frankincense. But seriously, like some people, depending upon your body chemistry, your hormone levels, if you've got certain things out of whack, like for me, it was my liver. For some people, it's their thyroid. Um, I've run into people who have like an endocrine system disruption, and they hate the smell of lavender. And I'm like, what? How can you hate the smell of lavender? It all just kind of depends on where your where your body pH and chemical and hormone levels are at. If you're all out of whack, if you've got super high chemical toxicity levels in your body, some of these oils might not smell that great. So don't be discouraged of like, oh, I hate the smell of that oil. Sometimes that's exactly what your body needs. When I started diffusing frankincense and throwing it, not throwing it, rubbing it gently over my liver, <laughs> like those kinds of things. Not that I forced myself to get used to the smell, but my body started repairing itself. And frankincense is really good for cellular healing and cellular repair. 
And so when I started that healing process and that detox journey and those kinds of things, oils started smelling better to me. There are certain oils. I loved the citrus ones. I would focus on the citrus ones and those still are my favorites, but other oils that I couldn't tolerate are now, I like frankincense. I chose to diffuse frankincense in Northern Lights Black Spruce because they smell good to me. So don't be discouraged if you open a bottle of oil and you're like, oh, that's awful because that might be exactly what your body needs right now. So a little bit, like throw nine drops of lemon and one drop of frankincense in your diffuser, get your body the help it needs, and eventually as your body heals, you'll start to love those oils that you're like, oh, for right now. That's my, my two cents worth on it, because I've been there. I've, I've struggled through that. Um, Janelle talked a lot about opportunity a month ago, and Luke talked about opportunity stuff two months ago. So this month, um, I just wanted to focus on, with Christmas coming up, everybody's budgets get a little bit, because eh, we've got holiday parties and extra food we need to bring to occasions, and I'm supposed to bring a beverage for this, and I'm supposed to make a dessert for that, and so Food-wise, the budget gets a little tight. Maybe your family Christmas looks like everybody go out to eat and you're spending 25, 30, 40 bucks a plate. Um, and that's a little bit penny pinching. Maybe, like me, you've got a big family and lots of people you're buying gifts for and lots of in-laws added and lots of nieces and nephews added and you're stretching your dollar a little bit more with buying gifts. This year, I had a wonderful blessing of being able to do, I'm advertising another company here, but I got to do an Usborne Books party because my girls are obsessed with reading, right? I mean, like, obsessed with reading. All they do is read books. Um, so I did an Usborne Books party, and I got all of my hostess rewards for free, even my half price books. And how did I do that? I used my Young Living paycheck, and I got books not only for both my girls, I got books for a nephew, a little girl I babysit, the neighbor kids across the street who watch our chickens when we're gone, um, three friends of mine and all of their kids. I think when I added it up, I got free books, multiple books for over 13 kids this year for free. And my party went well, like for an Usborne Books party, I got a decent number of orders, so I got a decent number of free books stuff. But like the amount that I got with half price stuff and didn't have to pay for because I used my Young Living paycheck. How awesome is that? So I got all of these gifts for all of these kiddos and didn't have to pay for them because my Young Living paycheck paid for it. And um, I was looking at Luke needs some new shirts for work. And we were like, oh, where is that going to come out of? They're switching over their uniforms and the shop pays like X number of dollars for it or whatever. But then where's that money going to come from? Because we didn't really have money allotted for the adult clothing budget for this month. And I was like, that's okay. I got some extra in my Young Living paycheck. So I was able to cover that for my husband's work. And what was the other thing? Like a gas expense or he needed a car part or something. It was one of those like... Typically, that would come out of the emergency fund. It was an unexpected expense that we had, and I was like, that's okay. I've got that left over in my Young Living paycheck from the, from last month. No big deal. What a blessing, you guys. This is so wonderful to not have that financial stress, and I know a lot of families are really struggling this year with job loss or being furloughed or all that kind of stuff, but to be able to not stress about those small things and big things because the Lord provides for us through me just talking to you guys like this on a Tuesday night via web chat. <laughs> like this, this is my teaching. This has been my teaching since April. My, the last in-person class I was able to teach was in March and I miss everybody and I miss being able to, to bring oils to people's homes. But look at this, you guys. If you've been doing web chats for work, you can, you can talk oils. I'm telling you, man, like Ann and I and Janelle and Rose, we just share our story. 
we just talk about what we use oils for. We're talking about rubbing oils under our noses and diluting it and about embarrassing dropping peppermint in our eyes. I mean, really, like, we're not coordinated. We're not, yeah, uh, like, we're, you've watched us. You've watched me goof up and talk about one DIY and then name it something else. I mean, we're not perfect. We're just normal people like you. And we're able to give gifts to 13 kids for free for Christmas. Like, these are awesome blessings. And I want to bring you guys on this journey, too. And I know Anne and Janelle and Rose do as well. Like, we love this journey. We want to be able to bring all of you to the farm in Mona in a couple of years. Mm -hmm. Like, that would be so much fun. So those are the blessings I wanted to talk about tonight with the business opportunity. Just the the less financial stress and the, the ability to pass those blessings on to other people. I mean, being able to buy books for neighbor kids for Christmas, that wouldn't have happened for Young Living. We would have been like, okay, we, get, we have this much money for the nephew and this much money for the niece. Like, and now it's like, oh yeah, we can get books for the neighbor kids. That's no big deal. Mm -hmm. It's such a blessing. I love it. Anything you want to throw in there, Anne? Well, I just want to, I'm, I'm with you, Tessa, you know, it is, it's one of those, one of those opportunities that I'm glad I got on board with. Mm -hmm. uh, number one, I love helping people. I have, you know, a 30 year fitness industry background. Um, so essential oils just made sense to me, you know, health and wellness fitness and wellness, you know, well, essential oils is all about wellness. I love being able to go, let's say to a store like a Walmart and I don't even need to cover the aisles of the laundry soap and, and all of that stuff. I don't even need to go down those aisles. So I'm cutting my time down being in oh, this. Yeah. Number one. Number two, I'm having the best products delivered right to my door and and because I have such a phenomenal team, we, we educate each other so that we can educate other people so that we can continue to educate other people. So you get it. It's a, it's a snowball thing, right? We, we want to bring, we want to bring the good news of essential oils um, to people yep. because we care about them and we, we don't want them to be dealing with things in their, in their lives, in their health um, that, you know, gee, you know, if, if you just remove this chemical from your home, eh, you might, it might really help. Mm -hmm. So, um, so that's kind of our job is just to care for one another. And in turn, we are truly blessed by the income potential. Mm -hmm. it's it's awesome. And it's not just, you know, like you heard us talking, talking about essential rewards. Well, essential rewards, I mean, if everybody is on board and they're purchasing their things like laundry soap and dish soap and dishwasher soap and all of that, if they're purchasing it from Young Living every month and replenishing their, their essential oils, because, you know, again, this is a consumable product, right? Mm -hmm then you're going to be buying that pretty much on a monthly basis. So what that generates is a residual income mm -hmm. that you can, I mean, you can kind of count on. So as, as you share with more and more people and other people share with more and more people, obviously that income is going to continue to grow. The neat thing about Young Living and its structure is that, so let's just say I help, I help Janelle continue to build her team and I help Tessa continue to build her team and I help Rose continue to build her team and they surpass me in rank. You know what I have to say about that? Yay! Because I know that I have blessed them. And in turn, I will be blessed. You know, sometimes it isn't all about, it isn't all about the money. Although that's good, you know, because then you're able to get, you know, books for kids. And you can, you have the extra money when unexpected expenditures come up. Um, 
but I just absolutely love how Young Living has structured their compensation plan in such a way that everybody wins. Oh yeah. Everybody wins. And it's, it's just, it's amazing how we can help each other and we can all come through on the other side. Oh, yeah. and it's just awesome. It's awesome. And it's I, awesome. And I love that we never ever teach alone. Like Correct. Today, I'm multitasking here. I'm double checking if anyone has any questions. Um, I like today, for example, I had a lady email me and I was like, I've never encountered this problem before. I've got a team of how many people and no one's ever had this issue in their back office before. So I quick hopped on Facebook Messenger. I'm like, Dan, Janelle, help. Have you ever encountered this? And within a half an hour, they got back to me, and I was like, okay, awesome. So I got back to that lady. You don't have to know everything. That's why we have a team. Like, I love that. When I was with other MLMs, I did not have that kind of support. It would take days if my upline ever got back to me. But with Young Living, like, we care about each other. Because like Anne's saying, when one rises, everybody rises. So we all work together. We all support each other. We, you're never teaching alone. Even when teaching classes in people's homes, someone would ask me a question. I'm like, I don't know. Let me call Janelle quick. She's a nurse. She probably knows. And I'd call her. And if she wasn't available at that moment, she'd text me back or she'd send me a Facebook message. And then I'd get back to the person after the class. We, you never teach alone. You're not by yourself in this, which I absolutely love. All right. Let me... B got on. Awesome. And Marie is on. Okay, wonderful. I don't see any questions. If anyone has any questions, please post those quick, and then we're going to do the prize wheel. Um, I know we talked about a lot tonight, so if you have questions, even if you come to them later, that's fine. Uh, and do you see anybody watching live on yours? No, I do not. Okay. I'm just adding everybody. I almost forgot dad. Sorry, dad. Let me get you in here. <laughs> All right. I think that's everybody who's watching live. Let me... All right. Um, and did you have, we had talked about, um, we wanted to start something new with you guys. Um, sorry, I'm trying to type and talk at the same time. Um, did you have a motivational quote that you wanted to share with us? Otherwise, I've got a few. Um, well, I am going to go with my Something I always, 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 always think about is, you know, everything always begins with a dream. Okay. So my dream has been, I want to be able to help people. Um, so just think about everything always begins with a dream and take it one step further and say, how can I help people? I like that. No, I'm just going to leave that right there. <laughs> we wanted to start giving you guys motivational quotes because as you go through your week, we wanted to give you something. We wanted to end with something to kind of like push you through the next week. And especially with it getting dark so early, people tend to have like seasonal affective disorder and things like that. Just like, getting dreary. So we wanted to start doing motivational quotes to help you guys get from one week to the next when you can join us again. So that's something new we're starting. All right, let me pull up the wheel of names because I'm pretty sure I caught everybody from everything, Zoom and Facebook, and share screen. Share computer sound, and scroll down. All right, everybody ready? Go. Woo! Thanks for joining us live.
live tonight, Marie. All right. So, um, thank you all for joining us tonight. And we love sharing all of our oily experiences and our stories with you. Um, if you haven't started your journey yet, we can help you with that. Um, you can just reach out to whoever invited you tonight, uh, be that Anne, be that Janelle, be that Aunt Wendy, be that Rodney, be that myself, um, whoever it is that invited you to join us tonight, by all means reach out and we can help you start your oils journey. Um, as you're watching the replay, make sure you do those comments um, for those extra entries to the prize wheel that we're doing this month. Sharing our video gets you extra entries. Um, and then if you have any questions, by all means, if if you'd like to message us, personal message us, you can do that. Otherwise, you can toss them in the comments and we'll either reply to you in the comments or we'll talk about it next week. Um, until next time, I think that's it. Next week, we're doing the Oils of Ancient Scripture. That's the one we're talking about. I wanted to double check and be sure. <laughs> we're discussing Oils of Ancient Scripture for the next three weeks. I'm very excited about this. I am very excited as well. This is like the perfect time to do it with Christmas coming up. Yes. Agreed. Agreed. I do my research and the more research I do on these oils, I'm like, oh man, I need more of those. Oh man, I got to diffuse that one more. So very excited. And I just want to just add that um, when I got my um, oils for, you know, ancient scripture um, I used my essential rewards points for that. Mm -hmm. Just saying. <laughs> Just saying. <laughs> Just saying. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> well, I hope you all have a wonderful week. Blessings to all of you. We will see, see you same time, same place next week. You bet. Bye, Bye. everybody. <laughs>